Hello everybody, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are in the world. Country Dad Kicks back with another Facts About Kicks. I'm sorry, this one was meant to come out on Sunday, but I've been quite ill. I even thought I had COVID again, but I definitely haven't got the COVID again. And uh, yeah, I've been decorating my house. Um, yeah, at the moment, I'm in the middle of decorating my house. So yeah, Facts About Kicks. As requested on the story, we're talking about a shoe today that it can be seen on runners, it can be seen on teenagers, people in fashion, just, yeah, it can be seen lots. It started way back, uh, I'm not gonna drop the date because I'm gonna get into the facts about it in a minute, but it can be seen now, not just on runners' feet, okay? Very comfy shoe. One of my favorite Nike shoes, awesome shoe. No, it's not an Air Max. Let me get into it. Today, we are talking about the Nike Air Hirachi, designed by one of the greatest sneaker designers in the world. I talk about him a lot on my Facts About Kicks. Everyone knows who Tinker Hatfield is, especially if you're a fan of Air Max, which most of the people on my page are. Um, big up to Tinker because I wear a lot of your shoes, mate. You have made some bangers. And this right here is a banger, an ultimate banger. Like it started as a runner and now it can be seen, like I said, Lots and lots of people wear Harachis. It's like a high street shoe and it's everywhere, isn't it? So, and this one here, this was a, a Nike Stussy collab that released quite uh, quite recently. I've got another pair down here, which it, it brings significance because for me, this shoe down here, let me just let me just reach down and grab it for you right now. So, this one here, I remember the hype behind the triple blacks. Okay, this is probably my favourite Harachi, and like, and I'll never part with this shoe. Um, but yeah, this, this one here, let me just, before I start dropping facts again, this one here, I remember the hype, like this sold out like Jordans and Yeezys and stuff like this. Like you couldn't get this shoe anywhere in certain places. Like JD Sports sold out, like lots of people sold out this shoe. Um, so that's why I think this one, I had to pull this one. I've got a few pairs in my collection in the sneaker cave, but this one here was uh, a very dominant shoe and if you know about shoes and you're a fan of like nikes and you wear them a lot you know what i mean when i say when the triple blacks were released they made a hype like they actually did they made a hype the triple black karachis but yeah so these are the stussy ones these released again quite recently um let me start dropping some facts for you so the shoe was released in 1991 it was created by tinker hatfield and it was made and named it was named after uh, an American native sandal, the Harachi. So, have you hugged your foot today was the slogan by Nike when it came out in 1991. And a lot of people didn't, same kind of thing with the TM. They didn't know if it was going to run or not. And inside here, it's got like a sock that when with the slogan, hugs your foot, it really hugs your foot. And it's got this back strap it at here. And it's one of the first products of Nike where they didn't put the Nike Harachi the Nike Harachi, see it's on my brain. I've been studying, that's why. It hasn't got a Nike swoosh. It's just like, you know, it's got the name Nike at the back and it's one of the first shoes where they really didn't go with the Nike swoosh. Um, Tinker, you're a legend, mate. You're a legend. If you watch these videos, if you ever watch these videos, dude, you're a legend. Thank you for bringing these shoes to the world, mate, because you have smashed it, I swear down, from the Air Max 90, the Air Max 1, the Jordans, the Harachis. Come on, bro. Like, you are a legend, certified. Um, so, yeah, requested. Harachis, they are so comfy, and they are lighter than a feather. Like, <laughs> I swear to God, they are lighter than a feather. Like, that is no word of a lie, mate. They are. And if you're a runner or if you're into the gym, you no doubt see people working out in these, running in these and whatnot. And it's become more of like a lifestyle shoe as well, like I said, with fashion, you see it in the high street, you see it on like teenagers, even kids wear it. They've got obviously the infants that come out and so on and so forth. But just a really dope shoe that um, I highly recommend anyone who's into comfort. Yeah, I would say get them a, a half a size bigger, maybe even a size bigger because they're so tight when you put them on because of like the sock in, in a liner or the insole. I'm just going to say sock that's in, in it for the minute. Um, that's in it for the minute. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah so um the the sock line is it's quite tight and it the plastic here on this bit tends to if you 
keep pulling it on and off if you've got a smaller size it will snap and it will uh, it will tear and not a good look because they're a bit expensive now to be honest like i think these were like 115 pounds these were only like 90 95 when they came out i'm just going to check the date just so you can all 2014 so yeah if you remember back in 2014 when the black karachis the triple black karachis came out again on a re-release i believe it was a re-release they sold out they sold out everywhere and it was like a yeezy and a jordan like i remember going uh, i saw my friend had a pair uh shouts out to kiffy kiff posts um the he had a pair that he got from manny and um i was like damn i need to get a pair i need to get a pair i need to get a pair and um, every shoe shop in the city where I'm from in Exeter, they did not have any anywhere. It was peak. You had to really like wait. And I, I managed to get a pair. I went in there one day and I was like, you've got them back in stock. Boom. <laughs> Boom. Like, I was like, Phew. Phew. <laughs> I was gone. I was gone. I got my pair and they're still here now in the collection. They're a bit beat up though. I can't lie, but yeah. I need to um, maybe to get, to get them out, get some air around them, give them a clean and whatnot. But yeah. So facts about kits. Today, the Nike Air Harachi. If you have any more facts about this shoe, or if you have any comments or any questions you want to ask about it, let me know in the comments. Share, repost. Peace out. Everybody have a good day.